Hi everyone, how you're doing? We're going to get straight into it. We've got a few little missions to do. And is this the right card away? Is there anything cool hidden around here? Yes! Lots of stuff for me to take. Grenade launcher! Yes! <laughs> That's not a bad start. Oh, what the hell are you doing, Steve Dor? This is Halcyon News. Yeah, I've done we interrupt your regularly it. scheduled advertisement yeah, for the years. following story. Ooh. The board would like to remind spacers and other travelers that passage to Monarch is restricted for your protection. Oh, I'm just going to keep talking about Monarch, aren't we? Canyons of acid and sulfur rain are the least of the horrors plagued in Anarchists live as one with the animals, lawless. Savage and unimproved. Hmm. The board revival leader that nothing can leave the planet and threaten our vital citizens. This is Halcyon News, reminding you that there's no time to lose. No we in Halcyon and no Mercury in Saltoon. How weird. Cool. Well, I've got a key card to the rest and go. Apparently. Oh wow! <laughs> cool. Add drone. That was cool. They actually got me with that a little bit. I was a little bit like a child, and I couldn't help it. <laughs> that looks awesome, though. What's this? Drink efficiently. Sorry, people. I know I keep pulling my gun out. Oh, Lost Hope Bar. We move cargo 16 hours a day, and half of us still can't afford a bed. Vera. Seeking Hello. In the heat. Till June Lay gets those radiators fixed, I've got the next best thing. Ew, I don't suppose you know where I could get to Stella Bay on Monarch. Stellar Bay proper? Mm, tough to say. The board called all the nav keys about 10 years back when the corpse pulled back to Terra 2. Hmm. Do you know why? It's overrun with beasts, I heard. Big ones. Kind of chew your face off for fun. Might all be bored propaganda, though. If you're in Probably, to a degree. Bay, you're gonna have to get your hands dirty. The board don't like them that truck with Monarch. But I am the <laughs> one you ought to be asking. Try Gladys on the promenade. She'll fix you up. I will. Uh, you got anything? Nothing you need and everything you want. <laughs> got no weapons, no armor. Bit of first aid stuff. Yeah. Let's just sell you a bunch of junk. And off we go. You got anything else to say? A new face. Or Trezor and Sism. Heard anything interesting? Let's go with that. Shot down in Byzantium's holding auditions for a new adventure serial. So yay, another six of those next season. <laughs> What's the heat issue? Theaters, they're fucked ten ways to Sunday. And we're all sweating buckets wondering when the powers that be are going to get around to fixing it. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Let's go with that. Say, and I wouldn't be pouring drinks professionally if I could. All I know is <laughs> she's not wrong. Our own juices here, and it's only going to get worse. Uh, do you? Maybe I can do something about it. For me to say, but if you're feeling the urge toward helpfulness, you can find Chief Jun Lei in engineering. Uh, what do you know about the chief? Nobody who knows more about the station's guts. Any system you could name, June's crawled around inside and made it better. She doesn't come around here often, though. Don't see her as much of a drinker. Too straight lace for that. Bear that in mind. Anything interesting going on around here? Not really. That's a chef. 
Probably don't want to rob the chef. That's the shitter. I'll be just... Just a moment. Ooh. This is Halcyon News. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. Interesting. Do you have what it takes to defend... Oh, go away. ...from the dangers of alien Bell shells. Ooh, guns. You know that sound when you've snapped on an injector clip? Ah, that's how you know your weapon loves you back. I got a full line of weapon modifications I'd be happy to show you. Just show me some good weapons. Why, it gets you the weapon best suited for your lifestyle. All the better for performing a little percussive maintenance. Take your basic Deadeye Assault Rifle. Perfectly serviceable. But what if you like mm -hmm. finesse? Slap a scope and silencer on that bad boy. Bunker down in a bush someplace and pop off heads. What Sounds good. Getting in close and making a lot of noise. Extended ammo magazine and a barrel heat sink to bump up rate of fire. Hmm. Uh, no and yes. When you install something, it pops in there real nice, but if you want to replace it, the originals tend to snap like plastic toys. Hmm. Uh, just modifying a weapon void the warranty. Sorry, hon. Here at Bell's Shells, we just don't discuss impolite topics, and W-A-R-R-A and T-I-E-S tops the list. <laughs> That's all I need to know. What can I get you? Oh, let's see what you got. Uh, ooh, some of these guns look good already. Bunch of grenade launchers. Some revolvers. Plasma rifle. Ooh, I haven't got one of them. Auto mag pistol. Oh, I love the look of that. What's it got? An extracto site, post armor damage. Yeah. I might have to get like. Ooh. I think I'm gonna have to just buy it. What the hell happened there? And the same for this. Got no armor. Got some mods. Fun time barrels. Extendo sight. Gyro sight. Mr. Ouch. Mag 2 ray. You cannot purchase this restricted stock. That's kind of annoying. I have to see if I've got some. Uh, what's called myself? Got a silencer myself. Must have something like that. Stevedore. Udon Bedford. Uh, you know what? Let's leave Udon for a little while. Medical Bay. Are you listening to in fact, I know we've got someone to speak to in the Medical Bay, don't we? You can't get me out of there. Please Ooh. don't make a scene, Dr. Fenhill. I am not making a scene. I mean, you can make it a bit of a scene. Let's speak to her. Sorry, am I causing a scene? Yes. See him for we could have avoided all this unpleasantness if you just let me talk to Jesse in the first place. <sighs> What's this about your friend? Get one thing straight. Jesse and I are not friends. I just owe her, okay? Ah, lesbian lovers. I'm trying to figure that out. All I know is that she's been here too long, and she's apparently not receiving visitors. Hmm. Not even like her, but you're checking on her. You say that like it's weird. Yeah. Like <laughs> Jesse did me a favor and now I owe her one. I just don't like to leave a debt unpaid, that's all. Hmm. Maybe I could look in. If you know something I don't about dealing with hospital bureaucracy, I'll be impressed. Quest objective requires you to enter a restricted area. If caught inside, you will be shot on sight. Using a disguise will prevent immediate hostilities. 
interesting. What seems to be the problem? Okay. Uh, let's go. If only my other patients had so many inquiring after them. I'll tell you what I've told the others. The records say Ms. Doyle checked herself in and requested I admit mm -hmm. no visitors. The requests of our yes. paramount. So no, you may not see her. Uh, let's go with perception. She's not my patient. I'm certain no one on my staff would falsify patient records, if that's what you're implying. Can I buy some supplies from you? Sensation from Chief June Lei, I fear. Supplies are hard to come by out here. We'll speak to Chief June Lei in a while. We don't have the ability to manufacture our own medical supplies here on Groundbreaker. Regrettably, we are dependent on the board for such mundane items as bandages and antibiotics, as well as more critical resources like adequately trained staff. We'd nearly signed a supply agreement with Anticleos, but they demanded we only use their branded drugs, and that's simply not tenable. Nice to know. Take care. Okay, so if I go through there, I'll instantly just get shot at. Adreno, bit cartridges. Got it. Inside voices. Messages. <laughs> to Captain Erlon, subject, where are my automax? Uh, say something, Erlon. Both of the ballots. Return to root. Messages. Return to root. Logs. Staff shortages. I'm sending and coordinating with any other authority outside of the groundbreaker. The board won't dispatch a surgeon unless generally agrees to share a third of all docking revenue. Space's Choice won't send supplies unless we make an exclusive deal to use their products. No thank you, we've seen enough shoddy needle be breaking off in patients' arms. Here's chat with Junli. Fair enough. So, we have like the shroud thing. We just need a way to use it. What the fuck is wrong with you? Well, sorry about the heat. Chief Tennyson will get the radiators fixed soon. Of course, this heat sure makes a zero-G brew extra refreshing. It's an ale that's good for what ails you. Oh, and it's not the best choice. It's Spacer's choice. Taste the freedom. A lot of slogans to keep track of. Sometimes I forget. Okay. Yeah, you've been to Edgewater, it's fucked. <laughs> the invasion Aether Wave showed that famous Saltuna cannery, which I'm sure smells as good as it looks. <laughs> well, uh, don't go looking into it. You aren't missing much, it's a dump. Well, I liked it fine enough. I'm sure they're doing their best. That's the Spacer's Choice spirit. So, what can I get? <laughs> soap. Everyone loves soap. Everyone will love you for using it, too. I probably could actually do a good, like, shower. Uh, have a Ten look. years in a cryopod. What you got? Anything of actual interest? Not really. Uh... Moonman helmet. <laughs> What's this? Mechanicals, mechanics overalls. Eh. Hmm. Gyrosite, mag zapper. I'm trying to think, anything like a silencer? Nah. I'll take those two. Okay. Sounds good to me all this so far. Ooh, can we rent an upstairs room? We interrupt your rest. Oh, we're looking at here. And uh, welcome to the rest and go. We used to be the go and rest, but folks never knew when to leave. <laughs> Sorry. Business has been slow. 
Anything to Such a bad pun. Uh, looking for Gladys. You can't miss her. Right behind you, number two. First unit on the left, or second unit from the right, depending on which direction you count from. Uh, how is life on groundbreaking? Let's get a bit of an idea. It keeps its grubby mitts to itself. Chief Tennyson holds the ship together, the promenade holds our economy together, and sublight is the shoddy jewel in our rusty old... Hmm. How does the groundbreaker keep the board at bay? Our Chief Tennyson has an independent streak, same as her mother and grandmother who rode this ship on the crossing. There's a reason the board's embassy is a glorified shoebox. While Junlei Tennyson lives and breathes, Groundbreaker remains free. So I killed Junlei, and Groundbreaker is no longer free. Interesting. <laughs> that Lilia Hagen never met a debris field she didn't like. She freely admits she planted her roots in Groundbreaker to escape board oversight, but I think there's more to it. She's unusual in the head, that one. Hmm. Of course, most of our supplies come and go through merchants. Company ships and salvage runs are the only traffic we tend to get. I try and steer clear of that creepy fellow in the moon mask. If there's a cost to being a company man, he paid it in spades. <laughs> yeah, there's... I agree. Jesus, Pavati, like, back off a little bit. My god, the ass on that thing. Spacer. Move along. Oh, that's Gladys, I take it. Bless my heart. A stranger come knocking on a poor old woman's door. Hmm. You here for a particular reason? Or did the neighbors tell you how good my sugar cookies are? Made without a single natural ingredient. Or an oven. Just like store-bought. <laughs> uh, let's see what you got for sale first. Want a charming copper kettle off that girl who runs the pub? She's a fierce arm wrestler. But she's no match for your pal Gladys. So, what do we have in terms of guns? Restricted stock. Stuff I can't have yet. Salvager's helper. Hailstorm of corrosive bullets. The loading mechanism is complex, resulting in long reloads. Hmm. I like it. I'm going to buy it. If the game would let me. Oh, I can't buy it. It's five grand. <laughs> huh. Hunter's kit. Fun time barrel. Whisper quiet muzzler. Yes, that's what I want. Get out on the end of something. Great hmm. law, is it hot in here? Or is it just my glands acting up again? Oh God. Those have been the height of illegality since Stellar Bay turned their noses up at the board. You and I could be thrown to the void just for discussing such a transaction. Lucky for us, Groundbreaker's a free port. We're outside of the board's control. For the time being, at least. Now, I only have the one nav key. And they're hard to come by these days. Are they now? If you find yourself lacking in the bits, I might have an opportunity you'd be interested in. Well, I will take the opportunity. 10,000 bits! Fucking hell. Um. Well, I find I'm in need of a ship captain with a little moral flexibility. Look no further. Could help out the groundbreaker, as well as earn some bits. But if you've got qualms... Uh, no qualms. Do you know Edna over in engineering? Sweet as a pea, that one. On occasion, she'll pass along transmissions I might find interesting. She sent me a recording of a distress signal she'd scraped from the Groundbreaker's comm array. 
Curious thing is, interesting from an outpost called Roseway, and Angie Cleo abandoned that place years ago. Did she now? Why well, was it abandoned? I know for sure. Maybe it never. This is the important part. Comm centers don't operate themselves, Captain. Someone had to have sent that distress call manually. Those corps are cleverer than all get out. Might have been a ruse to keep the rest of the board from sniffing around. Hmm. Say no more, Amin. I've got an ear for intrigue and a nose for bits. I like that. Here's a copy of the SOS recording, complete with the coordinates. If you should find a secret worth selling, might be I could find a buyer. Corporate bigwigs will pay <laughs> top bit for inside information on their competitors. True. The more it's all about corporate espionage, isn't it? The less time they got to meddle in our affairs. Abandon outpost, corporate secrets, got it. Don't forget to come find old Gladys when you're done. Hmm. Now have any other jobs? Might want to acquaint yourself with Junlei Tennyson, Groundbreakers Chief. She's been trying to get a handle on this heat problem we've got. You'll find her fretting in engineering. I'd say she's a sweet girl, but law for fen someone call me a liar. <laughs> uh, let's leave. Anytime, sweetheart. You know where to find me. Here, take a candy with you. Interesting. What's going on over here? Am I not supposed to be in here? Well, time to rob these buggers blind. Squatter's Journal. I served on two corporate freighters before I got stranded here. Everyone's heard my sob story, but no one's listening. To them, I'm just background radiation. Wasn't my fault Captain decided to take off early. Wasn't my fault no one checked the crew manifest. Wasn't my fault they replaced me with a full-timer. Now I'm filthy, bitless, and bedless. As far as anyone's concerned, I'm groundbreaker trash. That's how I live. And if no one agrees to take me on as crew, I suppose that's how I'll die. Well, you'll also die with nothing. So, you know, it's worse than you thought. What's in here? Might I well feel like this is a bad idea? Where the hell am I finding myself? Oh, is this the med bay? This is the med bay. I need a groundbreaker ID. Have anything like that? Do the do? No. Uh, what's going on here, anyway? Hmm. Captain's identification. Geothermal password. First aid room key. Emerald Vale Community Centre. Junior Deputy. Uh, rest and go key card. Um, safe's in the rest and go. On the groundbreaker. Nice! Ooh. Cool. Okay, uh, let's slip back out through here. 
So basically I need to look like a groundbreaker. Up we go. This is Halcyon News. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. Hmm. Tossball finals are scheduled to air. Scandal has rocked the league and thrown this pivotal game into question. What's going on here? Pay to view movies, pay to view serials, guest messages. <laughs> One of the UB squealers came asking after you, wants to know if the, what you like to drink, who you talk to, and what his temperament like. Tried to pay me off, I took the bits and told her to pack off, told her a back of lies. Watch your back when you get in, don't want to find you in a waste disposal shoot. To Iceman. Icy, been a while since I heard from you. You're on that long haul out of Dash Gover right now, hope it goes well. I've got space for you, for yours, and meet when you get back. It's just a storage room, but it's quiet and safe than the bar. Should be able to accommodate most of your folks. No fees or nothing. Just let me buy you a beer. Mr. McGred, you have reviewed your proposal for the tenth time and still don't agree that Galactic Mushroom is an acceptable flavour for a Rizzo's beverage, even if you were to pursue the idea. The samples you sent us were dangerously hallucinogenic. <laughs> your open packaging alone caused mayhem in our receiving bay. Please don't reach out to us again. Any decent ones? My candid friend, Nana Spank. <laughs> oh, God. Everything about that's wrong. Toss ball cards. Don't really need toss ball cards. Crack! Oh, no. And I had no problem that time. The problem is I need an identification link. Identifies me as a very specific individual. Let's do your fish sticks. Bunch of bits. Hmm. Yeah, let's leave the vendor. Cool. Well, so we got Steve Dor and Udon. We went in here, didn't we? Yes. Hmm. What have we got here? Public terminal. What's this going to tell us? Recent users. Access user Callahan M. Displaying a recent message. You made your space of choice when you signed the employment contract. I keep telling you the hat doesn't fit me right. There's something wrong with it. How many people have worn this thing before me? Is this my life now? Because if it is, I'll take it. I'll be your moon man. But there won't be anything left of me to care. Hi, Mum. Are you okay, honey? Hope you're doing well, Mum. Thought I'd check in. Engineers visit the shop a bunch. I remember when I used to turn a wrench back home on Terra 2. Leo Hagen over the sublight told me that I could always pursue a career in salvage if this thing doesn't work out. Please give Dad and the others a hug for me. Mum, it's really great that we can stay in touch like this. Little reminders of home are more important than ever. Enjoy the quality space, choice of good sense. I sent. You can get ones just like them at home, but I figured you might appreciate me getting a company discount and all. Public notices. The heat. Uh, no, it's bad. We've got our eyes on the problem, hands and tools. Meantime, enjoy some additional water rations. Take breaks, you deserve them. Contracts of sublight salvage. Interesting. Payments in exchange for return of legal salvage. The details. Burr, 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 burr. Loitering on board property is strictly prohibited. Winky Corporation. I don't like Udom. Uh, first time I've had to post this message and I'm sick and tired of it. My is it's a board sanction investigation. Interesting. Add drones. 
Sublight salvage and shipping. Well, what missions do I actually currently have? No, weapons from the void. On um, groundbreaker. Distress signal. Recording on your ship. Solution vital. Worst contract. Talk to Jesse. Ellie hasn't been able to get through to Jesse, but maybe you could try. Uh, find an acid steeper. Salvage in the sky. Drinking sapphire wine. Let's go talk to June. I can have a bit of a walk around and see what's Spratwurst vendor. Oh, uh, everything about this is just wrong. This engineering. Auntie's kitchen. There's a lot going on. It's all interesting. It's all pretty cool. This'll be June. Those XF four elevens? And an old Yakita three seven? You think they'd let me peek at the power plant? And now for a special word from Chairman Rockwell. Hmm. Chairman Rockwell. Greetings, hard-working citizens of Halcyon. In these profitable times, we need only look to one another to find examples of our Hello. and earnest work ethic. But there are those who cheat and swindle their way through life. Interesting. Hard to see the fruits of your labor stolen by these vagabonds. One such man is Phineas Wells. This would be why... Uh... The board unanimously decided that in the interests of protecting our best assets, that's you, we are substantially raising the reward for his arrest. Interesting. If you have any information regarding his whereabouts, do your civic duty and come forward. Until then, my hmm. friends, keep working. Keep working and we'll keep painting you. Farewell. These people are bastards. Hello, June. June Lee Tennyson. I'm captain around here, but chief to my friends. Hope you don't mind the formal introduction. Groundbreaker doesn't see many visitors. Uh, I'm captain the unreliable, though my ship's been a bit grounded at the moment. I heard hmm. we had someone in impound. Wish I could help. I gave the bureaucrats a mode of authority over freight traffic, and it rankles them good when I challenge it. Just so we understand each other, I'm the final word on the ship. The Mardits, the crew, the engineers, their family. I hope there won't be any problems while you're visiting. Eh. I'll try not to start any fights. I may have to end some. Yes, because I'm a badass. So what brings you to Groundbreaker? I'm curious, even though nine times out of ten, the answer is just passing through. Eh. Uh. Once I get out of Impound, I'm bound for Monarch. Interesting. The powers that be paint an ugly picture of Monarch. Critters and such. Maybe someone in the promenade can get you the right weapon for the job. We see a lot of the I'm good. this coming and going. Most of them board spies and corporate sprats. Makes it hard to trust outsiders. <laughs> so welcome aboard. Hmm. Pavati, you want to talk to her? What? I didn't think you just... <laughs> is it? That's a lovely name. What can I do for you? I was just thinking, I haven't got much experience working with actual, real spaceships, Miss Junlei. Uh, uh, Chief Junlei. Junlei is fine. <laughs> no need to be so formal, Pavati. Force of habit, I guess. Um, okay. Since you run a whole space station, I would... Aw, oh, it's like a fangirl meeting, like, their favourite band. Some things. I could message you later, maybe? I'd be happy to make the time, Parvati. You can ask me anything. Oh. Right. In person. Sh sure thing, Captain. Wow, great. I I'll do that then. Messages. Later. Oh, your, your name's pretty too. I should have said... Sorry. I like it. Honest. Sorry. Calm it. <laughs> I'm going to be a bit of a dick. Couldn't have done it without your moral support, Captain. 
<laughs> now, if there's nothing else, there are other parts of the ship begging for my attention. I heard you're having a heat problem. Groundbreaker's radiators need replacement parts. They're dumping superheated air into my ship. Hmm. My engineers have managed to keep the heat to livable levels, but all the fixes are temporary. This wound is bound to fester. Only the board has access to new parts, and I won't let them swindle me into a corner. Hmm. None. Every time I give in to the board, Groundbreaker loses its freedom. Soon there won't be anything left. I can't allow that. The board isn't helping, and my resources are spread thin. If I don't get those radiators back online, Groundbreaker, everyone aboard, will be cooked alive. Uh, you need a contract to work this out. I'm available for a reasonable rate. <laughs> I'm pretty much a mercenary. That's the best news I've heard all day. According to my grandmother's old schematics, the parts we need should be in the back bays. Yeah, I'll take care of that right now. Back bays. Am I supposed to know where that is? Sorry, I forget not everyone knows this ship like I do. The back bays are on a lower deck, long abandoned and a haven for miscreants now. <laughs> hmm. Could we try to talk this out with whoever's down there? Have you tried sending anyone else? Now to get a part. I have. One of my engineers, plus a small security detail. They didn't come back. I can't oh, okay. Any it's on this job. No offense, but a freelancer like you is more dispensable. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Cute. My grandmother taught me that one. I was afraid it had fallen out of style. We like being a bit of a dick. I'll get those parts in the back bays. You can't get those parts anywhere else. Could try to talk this out. Uh, I'll get the parts. Once you've obtained the parts, we can proceed to the next phase of repairs. Excellent. And that, guys, is probably where we're going to leave it. Thank you very much, guys, for watching, and I hope you enjoyed that. I know the last few episodes have been very, like, dialogue-heavy and learning and things about it, but, I mean, look at this. It's just awesome. Everything about it looks cool, and everything out there looks cool, and everything out in the space looks cool. But don't worry, we'll get some shooting done in the next episode. We'll go do her mission. Especially seeing as I have a couple of new weapons, and I'd like to play with them a little bit. Where is my new laser? I mean, this, look at that. Bolter pistol. Oh, what a. I'm gonna throw that in there. And look. Dead eye assault rifle. That's just cool. Got a normal assault rifle. I could probably sell that. Got a grenade launcher. And a plasma rifle. Yes, I'm gonna have fun with those. Oh, what's in the journal? Oh, it's because I'm doing things. Thanks for your introduction for party. Generally hit off. Checking the party. Back on the ship. Okay. Worst contact. Uh, Corporal Wheeler. Stress signal. Happiness is a warm spaceship. Yeah. Okay, okay, but yes, thank you, very much, thank you very much, guys, for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, feel free to leave a like. If you didn't, then feel free to leave a dislike. If you want to tell me how shit I am in the comments, go right ahead. I won't stop you. But in the meantime, thank you very much, guys, for watching, and I will see you next time.